that was jazzy with happy monday this is your wake up call my name is Keyshawn graves and today is january 23rd 2023 and we have an incredible call lined up for you today so you do not want to miss this make sure that you tag your people so they can join us join us and do this live with us this morning okay so i have a question before we jump in why did you start why are you here why did you start your health esteem journey? I think oftentimes we have to go back to that reason why. And I think that this is a perfect day for us to do that, especially as we are a few days away from ending World Health Esteem Month. Chances are, though, it was because you saw a vision which gave you hope, which led to you taking action. So have you shared your health esteem declaration? That's what we're talking about all month. We've been encouraging you to share your story, share the reason why you started, share your health esteem journey. And it doesn't have to be some grand thing or some grand story. But we know that vision typically produces hope for a better tomorrow. So if you haven't, maybe this call will change your mind. All right, uh, let's get us over to some recognition. I have Darren Ashby. What's up? Good morning, Keyshawn. <laughs> How are you? I'm doing well. Good. All right. Good morning, coaches. As Keyshawn said, we have some recognition, so let's get to it. Here we are with our newest Diamond Coaches. Congratulations to Sophie Baudry, Krista Bauer, Elma Daniel, Magda Fabri, uh, Michelle Gavrash, Courtney Hyde, Shaley Perkins, and Virginia Savaria. All right. Those are your newest Diamond Coaches this week. Congratulations, guys. Now for our new star diamond, congratulations to Hannah Hefner. Way to go, guys. All right, coaches, that's it for us today for recognition, short and sweet. If you know any of these coaches or their teams, reach out to them, congratulate them today. And let's move the call along and get it back to Keyshawn because we have some amazing stuff today. Yes, we Keyshawn. do, Darren. Thank you so much. And congratulations to all of those coaches that were uh, uh, shared, uh, recognized today and to all of the teams that were represented. Okay, so I have just a few announcements for you. The first is about your Shakeology dessert plan. If you prefer shakes or if you prefer snacks, there is a dessert plan for you. Um, we have personalized or created some personalized plans for you. So make sure that you go to your back office to find and create your dessert plan uh, with Shakeology is three dessert plans for each Shakeology flavor and their seven day plans that can be repeated, that can be adjusted, that can be built upon, but they are customizable for you and for you to help your people uh, consume something so great, <laughs> which is Shakeology and in the way that makes sense for them, whether it be in shakes or whether it be in snacks. So make sure that you visit your uh, dessert plan folder within the Shakeology product toolkit in your coach office. The next announcement that I have is all about Bum, ba, dum, bum, our success club executive promotion. If you have not seen in your back office, we have made some really great changes to our success club program. And one of them is a new recognition level within the program, which is called our success club executive. And we are kicking off this first opportunity to be a part of this first class of coaches who are going to be recognized on stage because they are they reach success club executive by the end of this year. We're kicking that off with our success club kickoff promotion. So this is where you hit Success Club yourself and you get invited to a Confidence Catalyst training session. There's two of those with Petra Kolber. And if you have not already joined her Body Mindset group on Facebook, whoo, she is incredible. And there is a lot of great uh, takeaways that you can work to implement as we as we are building upon our health esteem journey and sharing our health esteem declarations. Also, in addition to our kickoff for our Success Club do executive program. We're also in the middle of double trip dollars month. Woo! That is a lot to say, y'all. But just know that this is a month that you definitely want to kick it off, kick off this year strong. Uh, when you're focusing on helping people, Success Club is really a byproduct of that. And so we really want to, to you to, to, to help people this month. And when you do, there are some things that you will achieve, whether it be the double trip dollars, which we're giving 10 trip dollars for every one success club point. This goes towards your success club trip. We know that we're going to Punta Cana next year. Whew. Anyway, go to FAQ 7493 to learn more about those things. Also, we have made uh, your user experience a little bit easier for upgrading body annual memberships within the self-service. So you can now help your coaches and your customers upgrade to body annual membership in only three clicks. So 
uh, if you that that was announced on January 10th. So if you haven't already noticed that, go check it out and invite someone to maybe upgrade to a body annual membership. OK, last announcement that I have, and this is a big one, y'all. So last month we did a share a cart sure thing promotion where people entered a drawing to win 20,000 bonus points. And we have the final winner for y'all today. Our final winner for that incredible promotion is Terry Ann Bandura from Canada. So if you know Terry Ann, you may just show her some love in the comments. All right, Terry Ann, congratulations. And let's move this call over because y'all, I listen, this is one that you are going to want to listen to and listen to and share again. Because like I started the call, the reason why you guys started is the catalyst to the change. And typically it's because you had a vision and we have the opportunity to share a vision for someone else by sharing our health esteem declaration. And that is what our guest speaker, a 11 time elite coach, 2018 CEO award recipient. She is a superstar diamond too. You may know her as a part of Team Diesel Nation from Miami, Florida. Please help me welcome to the call, Christina Delgado. Ah, uh, thank you, Fishan. I am so excited to be here. I am so excited for you to be here. And listen, I'm going to get out of your way because I know when we're talking about our why, when we're talking about the vision, when we're talking about putting the stake in the ground, there is no one better than you. So I'm going to get out the way and let you go. Oh, deep breath. I have my tissue because if you saw on social media yesterday, I tried working through this presentation with my husband and I was crying like a baby. And it's because I love this so much. And I love this company so much. And I love my team and the network. And today I want almost to give like my own personal state of the union address. <laughs> I want to have a much needed conversation about elevating, shifting, and creating a new direction and outlook for our company. You guys, I need you to stay with me all the way to the end. I need you to tag your coaches like Keishan said when we got on this call. I want you to share this call into your team pages because it's important, it's timely, and it needs to be said. And before I get to the real message of we are body, I just need to say this, I need to set it aside, and I need to move on. Competition only exists if you allow it. I'm going to say that one more time. Competition only exists if you allow it. Full stop. Whenever a company undergoes any kind of significant change, like what we are experiencing right now, transitioning from beach body to body, some will use that to generate confusion and narratives that are smoke in mirrors for their own personal gain. They trick people into joining their new and exciting opportunity. Yet history has proven that the only small victories that they can claim are the low-hanging fruit that will latch onto any narrative that validate their identity stories and their own limiting beliefs about their potential. Be weary over someone who talks poorly over something they claimed last week to be life-changing in order to recruit you into a new business this week. I'm setting that aside now. But let's talk about this for real. What is true right now is that we, the company, the network, and even you and I are in a state of transition and change, and that is never easy. With change comes uncertainty, a shakiness under your feet. We talked about this this, uh, this uh, past Saturday at Megan's gym. We hosted an event. I asked everybody, do you feel a shakiness under your feet right now? And everybody said, yes, and I feel it too. And that shakiness over time, it has the power of disrupting your mindset and your focus. But I want you to understand that it's very common. It's common to feel that way when change is happening, not just in our business and life, but it's also really easily adjusted. And that's the important part of this. I read this quote. I wanted to share it on this call because it really is the crux of my message today. Change is the law of life. And those who look only to the past or to the present 
are certain to miss the future. Change is the law of life. And those who only look to the past or the present are certain to miss the future. I am personally looking at the future and I hope you join me. I want everybody on board with me because we are body and we are just getting started. To my core, body has no competition. For 12 years that I have been building this business, I have felt this in it felt this and experienced this to my core. And it's not because I am naive to the fact that other fitness platforms exist and are be, being created at lightning speed, that other shakes have been created, that other companies sell a bike. What makes this different is us. The us that believes that this is the greatest opportunity in the world because our paychecks mean something more than what it could buy us. It represents impact now and for future generations on so many important levels. But let's have this open conversation about change and transition because whether you are a new entrepreneur here with body or you are a veteran entrepreneur with body, having perspective on how a business flows through seasons is key to staying focused and productive. Imagine for a second if Apple had thrown in the towel when the Macintosh started to lose its edge. When I started coaching, <laughs> I looking back at this as I laugh, when I started coaching, we had two flavors of Shakeology. One of them was green. We had DVDs and a bottle of vitamins. That's it. That was our product line. Two flavors of Shakeology, DVDs, and a bottle of vitamins. We have, we have seen, you guys, Shakeology expand into five flavors, two different formulas, and our favorite seasonal flavors, which are awesome. We have, I mean, I don't know if you guys remember, but, and this is like a funny part of the whole transition from where we were back then to now, but like in 2013, they changed the flavor of Shakeology and people thought the, like the world was coming to an end. Like I am not joking. And those are kind of the things that have happened over the last 12 years. Do you remember the three-day Shakeology cleanse? Now this is going old school. Well, that sparked the wildly successful three-day refresh. And we went from e and &E, I don't know if you guys remember that. It was like a black market uh, thing for e and &E when e and &E was discontinued and the performance line was continued. And now we can't even fathom fathom a day without energize in our lives and recover in our lives and of course we launched Beachbody on demand and then most recent we saw our company acquire mix we launched the body platform and we further expanded our very comprehensive wellness catalog to include first thing last thing beach bars i can go on and on and on and on but i will say that the most profound change in my years of coaching were the transition from dvds to bod and now the transition from beach body to body, two most significant. So back in 2016 and 2017, half the network was really struggling, including me, was really struggling with the thought that we had to ditch DVDs and go to an online platform. I know it sounds insane to think that, but we did because we only knew what we knew and that was how to sell DVDs, right? And we sold every program and that's how we conducted our business. But then there was like this other half of the company coming on board during that time that thought Beachbody On Demand was the best thing ever created. And it is, and it was, but both groups of people were right. One has had certainty, the other one had uncertainty over the same topic. It is how, they, how we chose to have perspective over that that moved us to the next level. But regardless of who you were at that time, whether you were an older coach or a brand new coach, it was getting noisy out there on social media. And as a company, we decided to reclaim our belief and start steering the conversation and re-focusing re, uh, the energy and the momentum on us. And that's when I Am Team Beachbody was born. And I can't, I'm not in the chat right now because I gotta stay focused on this, but were you a part of Beachbody when I Am Team Beachbody happened? It was, quite frankly, one of the coolest moments ever in my coaching career. We, and it started with our team, Diesel Nation, we decided to, to put our stories out there 
and create the hashtag I am Team Beachbody so that we could search and read and be reinvigorated by all the very powerful stories that had been generated up to that point because of Beachbody. And overnight, uh, the corporate team, they were incredible. They stayed up all night in the Utah office. They printed all of our stories out. They hung them up. And it was a constant reminder, not only to us, but to them, what we were fighting for. And it was awesome. It went on to you know, be used at Summit. We had t-shirts at Summit. You guys, it was freaking crazy. And those of us that participated in that, those of us that made the decision to renovate all aspects of our business to continue the mission that we were on, we got to experience the demand generated by the pandemic. Now, the pandemic sucked. It continues to suck and all of that. But at that moment, Beachbody was ready. We were poised for that moment and we satisfied the demand that the pandemic created for what we had to offer. And here we are six years later, undergoing another huge transition because we're becoming body. And not only are we propelling the powerful health esteem movement, but we're revolutionizing the business opportunity to impact more people while creating meaningful incomes for our family. That is body now. It is who we are now. It is the marriage of a deep and personal transformational health change within all of us and a business opportunity that can create financial stability and choice for our families. So I wanted to know if you were on board with me, if you're ready to create a new, fresh and focused day one. I know that it's brewing in, that, in the comments section. I know that the energy is starting to shift and we're creating momentum and we are going to create the We Are Body movement, but I need to have a conversation with you about your business because I don't want this to be a fleeting moment where you get excited and you feel connected and then you revert to old habits, old thoughts, and old results. We collectively need a shift and I know we can do it together. I want you to recognize something and it's something that I have been studying over the course of the last year and a half and Tony Robbins um, he calls this learned helplessness. And this topic is very complex, and I am definitely not a, uh, a scholar on this, but I do know what I feel. And then what I do know is that the last three years have done a number on you and on me. Woo, here it is. See, this is why I bring these. It has been a chipping away at our fire, little by little, some, some abrupt, Right. We have gone through hell and back. Some of you have gone through hell and back. But collectively, it has been a chipping away at our passion, our purpose, our fire. You guys, we're not alone. You are not alone. What it has done, though, is create a mindset, an identity of stuckness. It's a feeling like you can't figure out how or even why to move forward. And as a company and as a society, this is a fundamental issue that we need to recognize and deal with head on. Why? Because I have seen greatness. I have watched people join this opportunity hmm, and create massive results. I have been in awe of watching what society would deem to be a regular person, a regular mom, a regular dad, create mind-blowing results in their lives, in their families' lives, and generationally. You guys, to my core, that is still available. But we need to learn how to combat learned helplessness and stuckness. Tony Robbins talks about the fundamental human needs of certainty, variety, significance, connection, growth, and contribution. And I feel if we can wrap, if we can wrap up our thoughts around these six human needs right now and focus on how we can improve our mindset around our businesses, we are poised for greatness.
So let's break this down. The first one is certainty. We are uncertain. This is how I started this call. There is uncertainty happening around us right now with the transition, with the world everywhere. But you have a choice right now to create certainty in your business. How you do that is number one, reestablish your belief. Go back to the day that you said yes. Why did you say yes to this? What were those feelings? What were those emotions? Remind yourself of that moment and what has transpired since the roller coaster that has transpired since in your life and who you have become or are becoming because you are part of body. Set new and exciting goals. I feel that many have become very passive over their goals in this business and that starts to seep into your mindset. Set goals and figure out ways how to achieve them. Learn the business. This is how you create certainty in your business is by learning it and all the incredible ways to generate an income in this opportunity. It's crazy. But take extreme ownership of your business right now. Create certainty, and that's step one in the right direction. Number two of the fundamental human needs is variety. When I think of the transition from beach body to body, I feel a new sense of permission to create individuality and creativity on how you want to build this business. Change it up. Change it up. Take ownership of the processes and strategies that no longer work. Adjust, invent, and get creative. You're responsible for creating demands for your business. I'm going to say that again. You are responsible for creating demands in your business. That is something you control. The third one is significance. And when you think of significance, we typically think of external validation, right? Recognition, which is something our company does, we do as coaches to celebrate accomplishments in this business. But I feel at this moment, we need to set aside external validation and go within. And I need you to create your own significance. I need you to go inside and give yourself the biggest hug the biggest high five and say, I did that. I'm doing this. I'm doing the hard work. I'm creating massive shifts in my personal life. And that is going to help and impact and create a ripple effect of change within my, my family, within my friends, within my community, with the freaking world. Take inventory of who you have become since joining and pat yourself on the back, create your own significance. Don't wait for someone to do that for you, for your coach or your upline. You create your own significance by stop looking at what you did in the past and start looking at what you can accomplish into the future. The fourth one is connection and love, my favorite one. And my dear friend Moira Kusaba always uses the phrase of get in the middle of the bed. What I want you to recognize is that many of you are playing incredibly small and you're perhaps hiding from your team or bringing your clients because of thoughts of shame or other limiting beliefs. Recognize that that is what's happening and change that today. Get back into your team chats, get back into your team page, get back onto your team calls. Do the things, do the things that create connection and love for yourself in this opportunity participate give back and be present that connection that you are responsible for creating no one else is will get you focused and aligned with the business activities that are going to get your business on track the fifth one is growth and this is obviously one of our vital behaviors it's personal growth and development one thing that we take for granted right so much we read a book and think we got it we don't this is a muscle that has to be strengthened. And if you want to create and generate momentum in a business that is going to create financial stability for your family, self-awareness is key to your success. Knowing to recognize when you've generated the feeling of stuckness within yourself and in your business and pivoting, shifting and moving forward. And the last one is contribution. 
contribution, and this is huge. Our human needs need contribution. And that means giving back. And that means impact. You guys, that is what we do as body coaches. When I started my business, I heard this phrase that forever changed my life. And it, it was help everyone and expect nothing in return. I can guarantee you that if you lead your business with that mantra, you not only will be blessed a thousand times over, but you will always find this opportunity fulfilling. It will never be about points. It will be about people. It will be about fulfillment in helping and serving others. Have you ever thought of your values as a coach? Right. I think a lot of times people get lost in their mindset and start creating stories and narratives about any business that they're in because they lose sight of their values as a coach. I started writing this list of values and I honestly, I could have written an entire book on what my values are as a coach. And I feel that if you feel these, the ones that I'm going to share with you, and it's a small list because I, I couldn't, I couldn't keep reading these without bawling. <laughs> You're meant to, bo to be body. You are body and you're meant to be here, grow here and impact here. When you are body, you know you are part of something bigger than yourself. When you are body, you are purpose driven and truly love helping people. <laughs> when you are body, you believe you will help change the little sliver of the universe that you occupy. When you are body, you are committed to breaking generational chains in your family with regard to relationships, health and wellness, and finances. When you are body, you want impactful income, knowing you truly made a difference. When you are body, you will teach your families the importance of wellness in a sustainable way. When you are body, you will love yourself at every stage of the, of the path. And when you are body, this is the one that gets me, <laughs> you are aware that your children are watching. Listen, I can go on and on about this. I can keep crying on a call with so many of you watching, but I just want to end with, I love this company. I love our mission, our team. I love this network. And I love that there is freaking greatness within us. After this call, you're going to start seeing the hashtag we are body all over social media. With coaches and body partners drawing their line in the sand, I want you to join. Unlike the I am team Beachbody hashtag that we shared back in 2016 or 2017, that was a proclamation as to why we stayed. I want you to share the we are body hashtag with a proclamation of where you're headed. Not only sharing your health esteem declaration, but also your commitment to paying that forward and to growing your business as a body coach and partner. I want you to see this as the biggest most collective call to action for this bit for this beach body body coaching opportunity ever you guys what we have is special what we are is unique and i want you to use your feelings and emotions to share what this means to you i'm super excited to watch this roll out you're gonna see mine go on right after i get off I'm, i've created my reel already my we are body reel and I'm really excited to see all of you in San Antonio having crushed the first half of 2023. Okay. Christina, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So many mic drops. There's nothing, there's nothing more for us to say. The comments are blowing up. We are so appreciative. Y'all, this is where we're at. We are body and we are going to blow up the internet sharing that hashtag thank you so much Christina, for your servant heart your leadership and your words today they were so impactful but y'all now it's time for us to take the action um thank you guys and i'll see you guys next week same time same place thank you